guess where we are again. There's a whole set of Halloween stuff right in the middle already. And it's only July. I detect pineapples. Roundy Bay. There's lots of plaids and stuff here and some stripes, but not much when it comes to kind of wild patterns, but that's actually a really pretty one. Hibiscus. Cook Street. Like I said, I see them a lot. Furniture, big old desk and bureau, I guess. I'm not sure if that's a buffet or what. I'm going to be really juvenile for the moment because look, there's a crystal cock. <laughs> I'm going to come back to this in a moment because there's some people in the way. pretty crystals on the bottom with the rim around them at the top, but I can't reach them. i to check something. This could be Fiesta, but I'm not sure. No, it's not. Excuse me. Is it for today? I'm not sure. Sorry. It's okay. Beautiful little coup glasses with the uh, gold rim around them. And all sorts of shot glasses. Huh. Chesapeake Bridge. Chesapeake Bay Bridge. I'm going to just show that to Tim when he gets over here. glasses and a couple I love these very pretty not a bad price either I'm gonna show those to Tim and there's a really cute Aztec pattern There is a huge Coke glass that I may take a look at in a little bit after I turn off the taping because I won't be able to carry it and the phone at the same time. I'll come back for it. 
<laughs> Little chickadee. But the uh, shelf that I have to come back to is the one with the poison plates on it because there was somebody in my way. And I love these. It's a little snack plate with the glass with it. I want to see. It doesn't say underneath who it is, but that could be um, that could be Hazel Atlas. And then there are these that I absolutely adore, but again have no use for and. They're out of their minds with the price. He's a very adorable gentleman on the other side, but he doesn't like to be on camera. Lots of plates, but nothing exciting in them. We had these at home growing up. And then this looks like Pioneer Woman. But I don't think it is. Anything interesting in the bags? Not that I can tell. what's going on but they have a ton of square glass plates it's like a crystal cake cover down there and some punch bowls it's a punch bowl honey there's a Chesapeake Bay bridge um, I'm gonna, there's something in here that at first I thought was really cool. I was looking at this and it, it is cool, but it's Avon. I don't know if that comes out on the camera. And then there's this that I love the pattern on. Once again, I have no choice over the music, and they play it way too loud in here. I can't do anything about it. And I believe it's a garlic roaster back there. I'm not sure. Can't tell. It looks like a marble, um, marble rolling pin. And yet another pair. I laugh about the pairs. Hmm? No, it's a Chesapeake Bay Bridge. learn how to use these coffee makers and I don't know how to. Ball jars for canning. It's very simple. This is for espresso. Can I film this? Go ahead. So what you do is, um, I can't where it goes. should be, you put your water and stuff. See, they didn't even clean it out. It's got the old espresso in it. Lovely. This thing pops out here. You put the water in and you screw it out. And then what happens is... It literally has it, espresso in it. It will boil the water that's at the bottom and push it through, force it through where the espresso is and come out the top here. Mm. And that's, this is meant for a single serve espresso, but the larger ones can do more than just one. Gotcha. But you just use the stove and you heat yeah. it over the stove. 
I want one, but maybe not that one. size. Actually, I would only ever make one small. To clean it. Look at the jelly belly. Now, if that was a juicy pear jelly belly, I would be all over it. I think I'm going to make my way around to the poison plates in just a second. These are very pretty. Very cheap, but kind of pretty. A very 80s sugar jar, sugar container. Little ice cubes that you can reuse metal and drop them in. You should ask them if the espresso in it costs extra. Gotcha. These are the glasses here. These are cool. Yeah. These are the, these are the solar system glasses. There's more of them somewhere. Soon. These make me laugh every time because they look startled. All of them that I see usually have two holes at the top over what I think I view as the mouth, but I'm going to go on the other side because this is the shelf that, is it a man? Is it a woman? It's, uh, it's Baltimore's train station. There you go. Here's another one of those glasses, Tim. Yeah. Let's see what they are. For use for light and votive candles. They're definitely oh, not glasses, okay. yeah. Well, there is a set that's very I'm, similar to those. That yeah. Are, um, they're actually the um, solar the system. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Poison plates. Or some of them are. This one is not. This is very beautiful. Oh, wow. This one's gorgeous but it's also chipped and Garden of Jewels Imperial <gasps> Egg I'm pretty sure this one's going to tell me it's poison on the back it doesn't say <gasps> excuse me goodness this is very pretty but broken so this is actually the perfect style, size to stow away Show you how this is here. It's a very interesting oriental doll in the back, and then a couple of them up here. And this is one of the frogs <laughs> that it's missing its, yep, the croaker bar. Because when you croak it along the back, it literally sounds like a frog. I'm gonna see this too. Very pretty. Uh -huh. Oh, there's a family of them. They go together. There's a whole family. See them back there? They're adorable. And there's the other one. I need to rearrange this whole shelf so that the family of birds are all together. Central Perk, if you're interested. It's a beautiful kitty cat. And another rooster. Nashville. I've seen that in the Baltimore edition as well. It's like a night skyline. This feels like wax and very dusty. A very pretty dog. Doggy. This is very pretty too. 
these actually sell pretty decently in the booth at uh, Bryce Armadillo, oddly. Nothing too much here except the uh, ha, 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 crystal cock and a little honey pot. I have to keep this family friendly. I'm going to stop. That's about it for housewares. Check and see if there's anything interesting later. Here it is, only July, and they have all of their Halloween stuff out. Now, I'm not gonna be really able to pull or to look through a lot of it very well because I'm holding something in my other hand that we're getting. I'll explain what it is after we leave because I'm not going to talk about it in front of the cashier. But we'll take a look at the Halloween stuff. These skeleton things always make me laugh because there are things like a spider skeleton which is anatomically impossible and I think there's one for an octopus as well um, some cute Ed Hardy glasses or Ed Hardy like anyway a lot of little figurines and stuff decorations Beverage container. Okay, there's the Halloween stuff and then some of the decorations over there. 